Hello Toppers, today our video will be different from the usual other videos. Today we will be discussing the most frequently asked, most common questions in surgery. So let's go. Common cause of lower GI bleeding in India is benign tumor, non-specific ulcer, cancers, rectosigmoid and hemorrhoids. I think you people might have arrived with the answer. The answer is hemorrhoids. Yes, it is sure. First complication of Zenker's diverticulum. It will lead to dysphonia, gastroesophageal reflux, lung abscess and perforation. What could be the answer? Answer is lung abscess. So, colonic bleeding in a patient of diverticulosis is from which artery? Inferior mesenteric artery, superior mesenteric artery, celiac artery and gastroduodenal artery. We might, uh, we might have seen these similar questions like in case of duodenal ulcer where the uh, bleeding will be coming from, in case of gastric ulcer where the bleeding would be from, coming from. So, similar type of question, I think you might have guessed the answer and the answer is Superior mesenteric artery. Most common cause of gastric outlet obstruction in India. Tuberculosis, cancer of stomach, duodenal lymphoma, peptic ulcer disease. So you might have guessed the answer. So let's see. It is cancer of stomach which is leading to the obstruction. Most common site of Morgagni hernia and the location is right anterior, right posterior, left anterior and left posterior. And the answer is right anterior. So Morgagni hernia, right anterior. Dumping syndrome is due to diarrhea, presence of hypertonic content in small intestine, vagotomy, reduced gastric capacity. Yes, everyone might be knowing regarding this dumping syndrome. Early dumping and late dumping are the two different types. And let's see, the answer is presence of hypertonic content in small intestine. Differentiating inguinal hernia and femoral hernia, the hallmark will be Pubic symphysis, femoral artery, inferior epigastric vessels, pubic tubercle, which landmark we will be using to differentiate it. Differentiate inguinal hernia and femoral hernia. The answer, it is pubic tubercle. Multiple strictures in intestine are found in radiation enteritis, duodenal ulcers, ulcerative colitis, gastric erosion and the answer it is radiation enteritis. So we can see this multiple strictures in case of uh, pa cancer patients after radiation most commonly. Massive bleeding per rectum in a 70 years old patient is due to Diverticulosis, carcinoma colon, colitis and polyps. This type of questions usually we can see like uh, they will be giving the case and we have to go to the causation or we have to diagnose the condition. So the answer is diverticulosis. Bowel can get strangulated in all of the following except rectouterine pouch, iliocolic recess, para duodenal recess and vomental bursa. So this question is very very important because there is exception. So be clear whether the question they are asking for exception or whether there is any trick in the question. Then only you can solve the answer easily. So in case of exam we will be anxious about giving the answer and we will go without even checking whether there is exception or not. So it is one of the tricky question. So the answer is recto uterine pouch. Lusoria is due to 
I think we had discussed regarding this dysphagia illusoria in esophagus video. And the option is esophageal diverticulum, aneurysm of aorta, esophageal web or compression by aberrant blood vessels. And the answer is already we had discussed and it is compression of aberrant blood vessels. Most common site for iatrogenic esophageal perforation. So be clear they are asking not simply esophageal perforation. They are asking for iatrogenic esophageal perforation and the answers are abdominal portion, cervical portion, above arch of iota, below arch of iota and the answer is cervical portion. Anteriorly perforating ulcer in the pyloric antrum of stomach is most likely to produce initial localized peritonitis or abscess formation in the following which place. Momental bursa, greater sac, right subphrenic space or hepatorenal space. So, it is a posteriorly perforating ulcer. So, if you are clear with the anatomy, you can easily guess the answer. So, the answer is momental bursa. Now, commonly damaged during McBurney's incision. This is one of the most important question. And the options are subcostal, iliohypogastric, 11th thoracic and 10th thoracic. If you are clear with the anatomy, this question also you can easily guess. The option is, sorry, answer is iliohypogastric now. Most common complication of hiatus hernia, esophagitis, aspiration pneumonitis, valvulus esophageal stricture what could be the answer and it is esophagitis diagnosis for ectopic gastric mucosa of Meckel's diverticulum so how we can detect it option fluoroscopy occult blood test in stool usg abdomen and radionuclide scan And the answer is radionuclide scan. Increased gastrin level without associated increase in acid secretion is seen in carcinoma stomach, gastrinoma, pernicious anemia, G cell hyperplasia. So acid secretion is not increased, only gastrin secretion is increased. That we can see in case of pernicious anemia which is not a feature of short bowel syndrome steatoria, diarrhea, increase in weight, malabsorption be clear with the question there is a trick that is not a feature of and the answer is yeah you can easily identify it is increase in weight then Hernia that least likely to get strangulated. Options femoral hernia, direct inguinal, indirect inguinal, umbilical hernia. So the least thing one, least one is direct inguinal hernia. Incidence of malignancy is maximum in villus adenoma, juvenile polyps, hyperplastic polyps, tubular adenoma. What could be the answer? The answer is villus adenoma. So, that is incidence of malignancy high in case of villus adenoma. Important prognostic factor for colorectal carcinoma is site of lesion, stage of lesion, age of patient, lymph node status. And the answer is stage of lesion. Triangle of doom is bounded by all of the following except here also again the exceptional questions. So be clear with that. Cooper's ligament, vas difference, gonadal vessels or peritoneal reflection. The answer is Cooper's ligament. So just go and read out the exact boundaries of triangle of doom. That might be a question again. 
different type of intersusception iliocolic ilio ileal colocolic and cecocolic and the answer is iliocolic this is one of the most important question true about carcinide 79 percentage occur in ileum and appendix rectum rarely involved 5 year survival is more than 60 percentage females are mostly affected and the answer is females are mostly affected in case of carcinoid syndrome mary joseph nodule is most commonly seen in ovarian cancer stomach cancer colon cancer and pancreatic cancer most of the people might be knowing the answer it is very easy so stomach cancer Most common cause of death in Crohn's disease is due to sepsis, thromboembolic complication, electrolyte disturbance, malignancy. And the answer is malignancy. Ganglionic segment is encountered in which part of colon in case of Hirschsprung disease? Distal to dilated segment in whole colon. Proximal to dilated segment in dilated segment. Answer is distal to dilated segment. Commonest site of ischemic colitis, hepatic flexure, splenic flexure, descending colon, ascending colon. The answer is splenic flexure. Which is not true regarding gastric outlet obstruction hypokalemia, hypochloremia, alkaline urine and metabolic alkalosis. The answer is alkaline urine.